Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, I've gotten a lot of work done on these behemoths here, which means that the painting is almost done. Uh, I've done. I did a uh, a gloss coat, uh, just tester's gloss coat, and then went over it with MIGS um, ammo, MIGS green wash for uh, dark wash for green vehicles, and it, it turned out well. You know, I, I'm still uh, waiting. I may take some more off of it. There, it looks like there's some places that need a little bit of. Uh, uh, cleaning up just so it doesn't look too dirty uh, then I'm gonna go through and sponge on some battle damage all over and uh, then coat it with a dull coat and call it call it done um, got one set of weapons painted up I got the flamers painted up so that's what the uh, emulator will look like they still need to be um, uh, highlighted and washed and all that stuff without I'll get to that when I get to them I need, still need to do the uh, multi meltas and the heavy bolters for them as well but overall uh, after some initial I really just stopped working on them for a while because I was gonna I was debating whether to go back and repaint all the trefoil wells as white or leave them as yellow and I'm glad I left them as yellow because that would have been a big labor and then I probably would have changed my mind later as well and you know most of these most of the foot soldiers have the tray full as yellow on all their all their gear and so I'd have to go back through and paint all that over again but you know I don't want to do that uh, mainly because I'm lazy but you know, there you go anyway uh, these look pretty good uh, I'm gonna finish them up and gloss coat them and then I'm gonna come back in and like highlight the wings here get them a brighter white uh, I need to let's see which one is it this one I really just need to repaint this and then put a decal on it. Uh, the skulls, I'm happy with the way they look. Uh, maybe a little bit more white paint, but the, the cloth, really, the, the gloss coat didn't hold on to that cloth very well at all. I had intended on in painting the uh, Inquisitor bronze plate here uh, with painting the, the, the eye, painting the, the sword and the, the book and the, all the letters, and then I tried it and it did, did not work out. My skill level was not anywhere near that, so I just bronzed it, made it a bronze plaque, and uh, left it at that. But anyway, that's that's some progress, which is good because this was a speed bump uh, for me because I, I got I just I just struggled with it. Uh, you know, I still need to highlight all the um, the viewports here all along the edges, and uh, really uh, after I had the, all these things done, I realized I needed to paint the the metal around the windows here bronze. Uh, but yeah, I'm probably not going to do that just because again, lazy. So. Well, we'll see. We'll see because I have to do those and then I'd have to do do this one as well. And then I've got the two exorcists that I need to build up and paint uh, and get those done as well as well and all that. These need, these actually need a little bit, this one needs a little bit more battle damage all along the edges. Because I can see it when I get up close, but until I get up close it doesn't look like it's battle damage. It just looks like further dirtying. But anyway, alright guys. Uh, that's it for a short update. Uh, once I have these all completed and I get some more foot soldiers done, I'll probably go start looking for games. Uh, see if I can get a, I can probably get a thousand point game with these all gussied up and ready to go. But anyway, hope you guys are having fun and I have been enjoying all the stuff. And then then War Boss, once I get around to it, I'll get into the uh, the Kingdom Death stuff because that that's gonna that's gonna eat up a lot of time. The, the models, though, the models, they, they're just beautiful. Anyway, talk to you guys later. Adios.